Well, an attack at an animal sanctuary left several volunteers hurt last week. 12 News' Gabriela Garza is joining us live at Tiny Hooves Sanctuary in the town of Dover. Gabby, good morning. Yeah, good morning, Diana. Right now, everything seems calm, and that's exactly how they like to keep it for these animals where they take in cruelty cases, abused and neglected animals. You can see some volunteers here are working. Well, things dramatically changed very quickly Friday morning. Friday was a nightmare, as most people who have seen the news know. Um, two of our volunteers were brutally attacked, and um, we have a lot of trauma. Uh, at the sanctuary right now, but we're surrounded by a really amazing community of volunteers and people, um, <clears throat> family, friends, Union Grove, Racine County. Now everything began here when volunteers noticed a goat was roaming alone in their parking lot. Now, according to the Racine County Sheriff's Office, Racine County deputy opened fire on a man who then returned as he was attacking people with bricks. Now those two volunteers who were hurt were Sadie and Taylor and Taylor sustained the most severe injuries. There's a photo of him on your screen. Uh, it may be disturbing to look at some of those injuries. Again, he's still recovering this morning. Now the sheriff says that the man even rammed a squad car with his truck and drove off. Deputies eventually found the man in a barn where they say he died by suicide. His name was Bradley Kupsiak. Now Taylor and Sadie are both recovering well this morning. Becca Thompson, she is the founder that you hear from here. Now she says that they are recovering. It's going to take time, but they are grateful for the community that they have. However, the Racine County Sheriff says that they did request the Kenosha Sheriff's Office to investigate this officer involved shooting and as that even though with all that preliminary information that has now become available, uh, they do feel that the investigator was justified in discharging his firearm. Diana. All right, Gabby, just a frightening situation right, for all of the volunteers there in that area. Gabriella Garza reporting live in the town of Dover.